Hey guys, it's Brooks. So last week I did a video where I reacted to some of my old cheer videos and I wanted to do a part two of that because I have a lot of cheer videos. So I have like the same setup. I have my laptop right here and that's where I'm going to be watching my old videos but I'll put it somewhere on the screen so you guys can see it too. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started because I still have a lot to go. Okay, so in my part one of this video, I mentioned that I left my first gym and I started tumbling somewhere else and then they asked me to be a fill-in. So I said yes, but I ended up filling in from like November to the end of the season because right after I started filling in, someone else quit. So I was like a permanent fill-in. So this first video is our first competition when I was at that gym. Um, this was two years ago and this is small senior four. I'm back spotting the basket in the back. Because... <laughs> I'm always back spotting in the bag. Kick bowls aren't bad. I know the tumblings look us though. Where you got a touchdown? I wasn't standing back, but then I backed up to the end of the floor because my two to back wasn't very good. I think we had a touchdown in that throw there. My bad two touchdown. It was a really good routine. We just weren't to the point yet where we were able to hit it. We had a lot of setbacks this year. But I mean, very nice softball. But I mean, like, I feel like setbacks happen every year, especially around the fall of cheerleading. Like, that's just when people start getting hurt, and people decide to quit, and stuff like that. I remember I marked this tuck all season because I could not hit it. I don't even know where I am. Oh. Oh, yeah. I didn't even get the whole video because I remember I cropped it. This video. My friend Lauren, the Lauren who I'm still cheering with and I met at this gym, she's in all my vlogs, she FaceTimed me this morning and told me that if I was doing a part two to put this video in. So I was putting a block of wood between my knees because I need to keep my knees together in my back handsprings. And this is how it went. <laughs> this is a favorite for a lot of my friends. Y'all, like, don't do this. I feel like I shouldn't have to tell anyone not to do this. Like. Oh, here is that same team at NCA. This is my first NCA. This was actually day two. That double basket always went to the side and we could never figure out why. Ooh, baskets were good. That was good. I missed level four stunting. No touchdowns there. And I was, I was in two to tucks. I was the one on the very left. Oh, this is where the fall was. I remember holding my flyer and just looking over and being like, oh, there goes our chances of winning in CA. Because we were in second, but first place was like over a point ahead of us. Oh my gosh, the girl who's doing the whip pass right now, who's closest to like the audience, she was tumbling on her, her fists. Like she hit the ground like this because her wrists were hurting. So she literally tumbled on her fists. It was crazy. I remember, I, I mean, I still don't know how she did that. Pyramid was better on day one, I remember. The timing wasn't great. I'm basing in the middle. I always end up basing in a routine somewhere. Except for this year. I don't this year. My dog just like freaked out. Ellie, come here. This is the only whip pass I've ever done, and I don't even do anything out of it. That was a huge accomplishment for me. Okay, this is me practicing my tumbling for tryouts. Yes! I like how I went, yeah, at the end, but like, that was not good. Uh, this is Fury at our first competition, and I'm the one on the right, on the very right. We had so much tumbling as a team. This team had good tumbling though. I love these motions. Okay, they cut me out because I was on like the very right. 
but I did my layout crooked. I wasn't running tumbling. So I did my layout crooked and I ran into the person next to me and I touched down and somehow she still hit it. I don't know how, but she stuck her layout and I literally like almost face planted, so. Oh, there's so many videos I still wanna show, but this is Fury's last competition. I'm basing the basket now and then I go to the back. The little lift thing. I'm gonna skip their tumbling because it's the exact same and y'all have seen it. I was so proud of this competition. This was cool. I love this. Because no other level 4 team like did that. Or that I've seen. I remember this competition being like, I have no idea what place we're in because everyone did really good. And my coach was like, y'all are in first by point and a half. And I was like, really? Because <laughs> I just didn't know we were that good. Land my standing back. If you look on the far left, that's our gym owner. And she was so happy for us. Like the very far left. I just remember that. She was so happy. Oh, and then I love that so whoever videoed this got the reaction. There's me hugging my flyers. Oh, that was such a good day. Okay, this is Lightning's routine at Summit last year, day one, aka the best day of my life. And I'm stunting. I do. I start every routine stunting, which I'm okay with. But I was stunting in the group that was closest to the front. I, I mean, there are so many girls on this team. There was 31 girls on this team, so I mean, it's hard to keep up with everybody. But that's another reason it was so exciting that we hit zeros, because we had seven stunts. So to keep seven stunts in the air, and these stunts were bomb. I mean, our stunts are bomb this year too, but I love that. And then we had a tiny little like bobble in the middle, and then my group was a little bit late. I'm the one on the front left. But it didn't count as deductions or anything. Kept it up. This is my favorite part of the routine. I just thought the transition looked so cool. I love how you can see the people cheering us on. Oh, this video is going to make me cry. Such a good day. I want to go back to Summit so bad. I'm in the stunt second from the left also, in case you're wondering. This pyramid is cool. It was so long, but it was so cool. I'm excited again. I'm excited for hitting zero seven months ago. <laughs> That's sad. <laughs> and this is what we do when we hit zero. And it was so weird because like, there's seven sun groups, you can't see all of them, but somehow we just knew that we hit zero. There's our coach, Oh, There's our parents. Oh, such a good day. I'm not even exaggerating. This is probably one of the best days of my life, like honestly. Oh, okay, Burke. Okay, this was finals reveal and it's in my summit vlog, but. It's also my pinned tweet on Twitter, so. I remember being so excited too because we were the first team that they called, so I didn't have to be nervous for a long time. Okay, I think the rest of my Summit videos are in my Summit vlog, so if you want to see those, go watch those. I'll link them below. And then for like this season, I can't really show any videos of our routine this season until it's over. So yeah, that'll be the end of this video. It was probably really long, even though I'm going to edit a bunch out because at right now we're at like 16 minutes. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see y'all next Tuesday. Thanks for watching. Bye. Oh,